nowadays to ignore the hold that heroin has on so many places in Garfield High. They are fed up and they are trying to arm parents now with proactive information before more families still feel the devastating effect of this heinous drug. These kids are getting it. They have access to it. It's all over. Out of the shadows and into the suburbs. That heroin has become the the most popular drug. Now it's heroin, heroin, heroin. Price goes down, so the popularity goes up. Ask David McKinney about the real cause. Yeah, God, thank God that I'm here because I'd probably be dead. In 2007, McKinsey was the man. Popular guy at Garfield Heights High School, standout quarterback, and then he took his first hit of heroin and started the downward spiral. Next thing you know, it's the epitome of evil. It's the demon. It takes control of your body, your soul, your mind. Mom never saw it coming until the epidemic was hard to ignore. He's had 17 friends that he grew up with from the Garfield Heights area that are deceased. It's happening more and more and we're just trying to do something about it. In fact, we didn't have to look any further than the end of this table to find another victim of sorts. The Garfield Heights mayor himself lost someone close to a heroin addiction. So he and police are hosting a drug awareness forum in the high school theater this Wednesday evening. If I could save some other people, anybody else, uh, the pain that myself and friends of mine went through, uh, then this forum will be well worth it. Well worth it because really the whole community is paying. David McKenzie in jail because he was busted red-handed breaking into a home. The majority of those types of crimes always have a, a drug addict behind them. But David, by, by the way, you watch. He uh, he's going to come out, I think, better than ever, really and truly, because he's he's taken it and he's turned that negative into a positive, and that's what they're hoping to do in Garfield Heights.